Let's uh, move it along right now to a side that we're going to do third. I don't think it means they'll necessarily finish third. I'm interested to see what Adriano says, but it's because of the Mourinho factor. Back in Italy, of course, this time with Roma, a lively pre-season. Red carded once already and all sorts of things going on here, including signings. Let's have a little look at the major stories as far as they're concerned. Um, he's turned his attention to his former club Chelsea and Tammy Abraham in a big money deal as the guy that he's brought in with uh, Dzeko leaving the club, of course, to come and help them get into that title zone. This is really interesting here because we look at the business done. Um, Shimura Dov has, has done well representing Asia, of course, uh, in terms of pre-season goals. If you look at what they have to work with, Adriano, I'm not sure that that is a, a Scudetto winning squad. But of course, mm -hmm. all the focus will be on the, the head coach. Well, that's right. We know that Mourinho will bring plenty of entertainment and drama into the season, as he's already done. You mentioned a nice red card to get his life at Roma underway in the, the pre-season. Rui Patricio comes in in goal as well. Look, there are some interesting names to be added to an already very talented Roma squad. And I think that is now the, the hope, I guess, for the Roma owners, that the experienced tactician that is Mourinho can really bring out the best in this talented young Roma squad. Pellegrini, a key player who has yeah. really come on in recent seasons. Nicolo Zaniolo, who hopefully gets back to his best after two knee reconstructions. And yes, the, the departure of Dzeko will hurt, but hopefully in Tammy Abraham, a player who has scored 30 goals across the last couple of seasons with Chelsea, has obviously played and trained with a number of the world's very best players. Mm. That could be the player to unlock the potential of this Roma team. So look, there is still some excitement about Roma, but certainly with the arrival of Mourinho, we're guaranteed entertainment, you're guaranteed the unexpected. I'm really excited to see the Capital Club, but hopefully at their best in the 21-22 season. Yeah, here, here. And although there'll be a lot of talk, as Adriana said, about him looking to re-establish his credentials, it's the, the youth and the talent in that squad that I'm really looking forward to seeing in action. This is potentially a wide-open Serie A campaign. When we come back after this break, we'll have a look at uh, not three, but four more clubs that you might argue will be in the mix.